What it do, homies? It's your boy Dave, and I'm back today. We back here with another Dan Vasque reaction. It's time we check it out. His Bring Me to Life cover uh, by Evanescence. Okay, we got a male version. Um, I think this is probably definitely a song that I actually I don't think I've heard a male version of. It's going to be very interesting. Um, of course, the lead singer, uh, a Amy Amy Lee, right? So you know, very very pleasant voice. Generally, when we hear covers like this, it's generally, I think it's probably more popularly. Like you guys tell me, are covers of this song more popular? Uh, more popularly popularity covered by other female artists so there's probably plenty of male versions out here um but we about to see dan vast because can't nobody do a cover like him okay let's go ahead oh another thing i actually don't know if this is a metal cover it just says it's a cover now dan is known to i don't know if this is a metal cover Hmm. I wanted this to be part of my metal tuesdays kind of thing and i know that he's <clears throat> I know he usually does metal covers, but it doesn't say it up there. So let's just hope it is. If it's not, uh, sorry, this doesn't belong in the metal Tuesdays, but honorary mention. <laughs> All right. Honorary, honorary reaction. <laughs> Like open doors Letting you down to my core Where I've become so numb Without a soul My spirit's leaping somewhere cold Until you My goodness, man. There's oh wow, his rage is just so impressive, right? Oh, that came through really, really clear. You can I, I can hear him sing with his chest when he was doing that first part of the lyrics, right? And, and Dan, he's he's like me, man. When he's performing or or you know, <clears throat> I give commentary with performers of a sort. Um, we just wear our emotions out on this on our face, right? And that helps connect with the visual, you know, with, with the with your viewers. I love to see that, right? Sometimes people be singing some really, really sensual songs like this one right here, and they close their eyes, right? Because they gotta kind of be in a feeling. Not Dan Bass, man. He gives us a thousand yard stare every freaking time. Okay. Every time. Absolutely amazing. And not only that, but the tone of his voice is really, really pleasant with this song. Of course, as we're listening to it, we're thinking about the original, right? And I'm sitting there thinking about Amy Lee's and I'm just like, I would love to hear them side by side. Um, like not side by side, but just like in conjunction, it would sound absolutely amazing. He would do well just overlaying her voice and, and everything will come through so clearly. Now, as far as range, that's just crazy. Okay. I thought Dan was going to, you know, weigh me up. But he went straight to the top. Dude just rushed straight to heaven and just laid it down for us. Now, here's the scary part, okay? We only one minute in. Which means we ain't hit Climax Dan yet. Oh, man. Let's go. No! Oh, I'm freaking dumb. I just knew it. <laughs> I knew it. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> and then he comes in and he's like, hold on, bro. Wait, 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 wait. He, he, record, he recorded this about a little bit over a year ago. No, two years ago. Sorry, uh, 2019. He must have known I was going to do a reaction, right? See, that part right before he starts singing, he was like, what to do, Dave? I didn't even have a channel at this point. I didn't, I didn't, nope. He was like, there's going to be this reactor. His name's going to be what to do, Dave. And he's going to say something about me, you know, going to the heights of the heavens and and singing and whatnot, you know, halfway. I expected something like this to come halfway, maybe maybe the rest of it. But nah, bro. He said, nah, we're just going to do, we're going to sing a little low for just the first part. And we're going to blow their heads off at the second part. Wasn't expecting that. Nice surprise. Let's go back so we can witness that again. Oh! 
Oh my god. <laughs> he done he done switched it up on us, right? He sang low. Oh my oh the uh Power grip. I should have known. I should have known when it came out. We was getting, oh my goodness, bro. Did y'all hear the intensity in this man's voice? Wake. He, Dan wants you to bring him to life, man. You don't scream like that unless you're feeling it from, from, from the deep. Oh my goodness, the aggression. So powerful. See, he, he done flipped it on us, right? <clears throat> he came through with the low singing, right? Mm -hmm. And then he sang the chorus with the heaven voice mm -hmm. yes sir and then he started with the heaven voice mm -hmm. all right y'all following me up with the lyrics and then came through with the dragon slaying deep dungeon bowser destroying rescuing princess peach whatever kind of mud slinging uh uh tree molasses um a maple syrup bath voice <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Dan Vasque. Wow. Instrumental break. So glad to see you today. Uh, it's always fun to sing songs originally sung by females. Woo. And by the way, I do a lot of that in this channel. Here's a playlist with all my covers of male versions of female singers for you to check. Huge thank you to my patrons. You know that's because of them that I'm able to do music for a living. This is awesome. I hope to see you next time. Until then, my friends, have yourselves uh, an epic day. Yeah, see, see, there's the proof right there that he had to summon his soul. His soul had to come through and just, just bless him real quick. You know what I'm saying? He was in touch with his soul. That's how he was able to breathe out. Oh, what an amazing performance, man. His range was just crazy. That last note that he held, held it with such, so much gusto. Oh, I know that took everything out of you, bro. You could see the perspiration on his face. That's why he was going, whoo, right? He hit us with so many dynamics. We got some lows. Dude was spitting some bars, right? It sounded really good. Took us to heaven. Dragged us all the way back down to hell with the vocals. Dude was just literally, like, you just... You see his head was tilted down. He had to tilt the head down, right? That's what dragons do, right? Right before they're about to eat you, they got to see you. So they look down so they can make sure, you know, they nose get in the way. And then they eat you with the monstrous growl. <clears throat> That's what Dan did. He summoned the dragon. He looked down. You, you can see. Let me see if we can go back a little bit to hold on. He had a part in here where look at right there, right there. See, see how he's looking down. That's just one of them secret techniques that the, the, the people who do those type of vocal abilities don't tell you about. But I see it. I see it, man. Excellent performance, Dan, man. Every time I do a reaction to your stuff, I am absolutely mind blown. Uh, <laughs> it's just amazing, man. What else can I say? Um, I do know that this isn't technically a metal song, but 
I did I, I really, really wanted to do it. So I'm going to slap my metal Tuesdays uh, uh, label on it. I just wanted you guys to know that because I know I'm probably going to get comments. This isn't really, really metal. It's more like rockish or anything. Uh, but it's Dan Vasque. Like I said, honorary mention. That's the end of this video. If you enjoyed the content, leave a like and subscribe. Dave's out.